welcome back to the street mic we are in norport it's one of copenhagen's busiest part of the city and we are about to find out what happens at norport such a beautiful city you will agree with me that this part of the city is very very busy but also beautiful so what are we going to find out let's go out and find for ourselves what is the best thing you can find here in norport let's go The reason why Norport is one of the busiest part of Copenhagen is it has all uh, the means of transport um, meeting together at one point. You have the metro, that is underground train. You have the buses that pass from Nor Norport, and you have the train also that also pass and have the stop at Norport as well. Hi. Um, so all this one here bring people together and. There will be a lot of people always at the same time in the same place so this makes this city part of the city very very busy and with a lot of people but let's go out and see if you can talk to some people and uh, also see what we have in this city Besides being busy, uh, Norport also have very, very interesting parts. Cool, refreshing, and calm part of it, just right within Norport. And I would like us to also have a look. So, let's go and see where are these beautiful, beautiful, calm, relaxing places right within Norport. I've seen bikes in cities, but here at Norport is a different level. There are just so many bikes. Well, maybe because Copenhagen is a green city, but there are so many bikes. So I think that's one thing that also uh, to be considered in in uh, in, in, in Norbro. Well, uh, just right behind uh, Norport, the most busy part, but you have here an open space. I'm told it's called Koltor. Koltor is just right behind Norport, and Norport is quite busy, but just walking like uh, 50 meters away, and you get this nice, beautiful spot that is quiet and always having, you know, certain performances, you know. But today is a very cold day, and, you know, people are just walking past, you know. But it's beautiful, right? Let's see, observe for ourselves.
So right behind us here, we are also at uh, Rosenberg Castle. That is right within Norport, the busy part. But it's quite serene, quite calm, open. And it's open to people to come in there and see, you know. Because uh, inside here is uh, Rosenberg Castle. Uh, historical part of Copenhagen uh, and, and Denmark. So you're welcome to see as you visit Norport. So uh, we are very lucky to have the, the king or the queen's lifeguard just pass by us as we are taking the video. But of course, you know, uh, for your information, uh, the Danish queen has abdicated our position as a queen. Uh, she's stepping down from the 14th of January. And so she won't be a, a queen uh, anymore. Our son will take over as a king of Denmark. So uh, let's bless the king as well uh, for this moment. And thank you so much. Let's keep going. Well, uh, just on the other side of uh, Norport, there's a Natural History Museum of Denmark. It's an open place as well, uh, with the water. Today is just a very cold day, so you can see the snow all over. But it's a very beautiful spot, just right behind uh, Norport. Not busy, not a lot of people. So you can come in here and also relax your mind from the busiest part of Norport. But otherwise, let's keep looking for the most uh, interesting parts here in Norport.